I don't need it. I don't need either of those things. I do not need a golden ship model. I do not need a coin from Hammerfell. Oh, God, no, I no, no. Don't buy it, don't buy it. You don't have the money. You do not have the money. You don't have the money. Go! Stop it! God! I need a torch. I need a... That's what I came in for. I need a torch. Oh, it... Just... It, they were there. They were... They were things. They were just... Oh, God. I'm going to go to Windhelm before I end My up buying lots more started. useless crap. So we're on our way to Windhelm without a torch. Which means, of course, I'm ill-prepared for any dark places. I cannot believe how much difficulty I've been having finding fairly mundane things. You know, trousers, a burning stick. Now I am going to take the carriage, but I am curious. Are these horses different to the ones at White Run? They probably are. I'm not sure which horse is more me. I'm going to find out how much they cost, though, just in case they're cheaper here, but I doubt they are. I have a feeling I need to buy a horse in solitude. Hello. Holf Greer Horse Crusher. You crush horses? Too lazy to walk, eh? Well, you found the right place. Oh! I, I'm, I've got to speak to you about uh, Helga. Before we do that, can we just, uh, we just, let's get to know each other. Ah, I'm not afraid of anything out here. Walls are just a weakling's hiding spot. Okay. Not me. I'm no weakling. In fact, I bet I got the strongest arms at all of Skyrim. I shall keep that. I bet you're wrong. No, I don't. Apparently I do. Oh. Sounds like I've got a challenger. No. Tell you what, how about a friendly wager just between us? I bet you my entire purse of septums I can beat you in a fist fight. No. You match the bet, and we fight until one of us gives in. No, I'm good, thanks. No. I don't blame you. If I were in your shoes, I'd chicken out too. It's not about chicking out, well, it's just a bit of a- still stands if you ever want to have a go. No, really don't think so. Not exactly a gentleman's sport. Well, depends on where you are, I suppose. Um, how did you come to be known as Horse Crusher? Been stuck with the name for years. I've been riding horses since I was a lad. Nothing I liked more. But as I got bigger, so did my mounts. And one day, I was drunker than I've ever been and mounted a poor colt. Broke his back in two. Haven't ridden since. Oh. So you're basically saying you're a little chubby to be riding a horse. I suppose horse crusher sounds a little better. Uh, can I buy a horse? I am curious before Don't I... Don't mind if you do. What's your price? Uh, no, it's okay. Should have known you'd be a cheap one. I'm just... I'm... Oh, dear. You received a mark of Debella. Uh, I'd like it. <laughs> huh? What are you talking about? I don't even know what that is. Okay. Hand it over. No one has to know. Give me... Or else. I have a feeling this is the wrong way to go with him. He's all fisticuffs and everything. Uh, look, seriously. Just just give it to me and I'll take it out of it. Oh. Is there somebody who should not know what you did with that young lady? Because cause I can help out. Just give me it. I'll be on my way. Look, you must have me confused with someone else. <sighs> yeah, that's not going to work, is it? Well, we could try. Give it to me now! You have a death wish or something? No, I've got a hankering for food, though. Uh, okay. All right, then. So, can I, can I, uh, wander around? Probably not. I'm gonna come back when you're asleep and rifle through your stuff. Yes, I am. I've got no real reason to actually, uh, <laughs> help her out, but, um... I just uh, kind of want to. So, hello, 
Sigor. Is it Sigar or Sigor? Double A usually is or. Need a ride? Uh, uh, tell me about Rifton. You can get a room at the B and Bar, but mind your coin purse. It's no secret the Dave's Guild makes its home here. It's not supposed to be a secret. Oh, and if you meet Maven Blackbriar, stay in her good sight. This is her city, and nobody else's. Well, we'll have to see about that, but yes, I will be nice to her. I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Windhelm. There we go. Windhelm. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Okay, then. Excellent. Ever been to Windhelm? Old no. city in Skyrim by some account. Is it? They say the big old palace there was built by Ysgrimor himself. What, like, all by himself, or did he, you know, have people helping him? Okay, you're feeling a bit thirsty. The carriage comes to a halt, and it's snowing. Now, I don't object to snow, really. I mean, it, it's kind of beautiful. And it's clean. And it does make everything look a little neater, and a little, um... Well, cleaner. Cleaner is definitely the... Word of... A Lundil! Okay, maybe I need a... Maybe I do need a, uh cloak. I'll tell you what, perhaps I should actually put on my uh, my hood. Wouldn't want to catch a chill, would I? Okay, so this is Windhelm. Oh, I'm thirsty. I will also drink. No, I won't. I'm actually out of water. I shall find an establishment where I can acquire... acquire... I've got mead. I'm probably still going to uh, go and find an establishment and see what I can acquire there. I do need to buy a torch. I mean, I don't think I need one right now, but you never know. Oh, God, excuse me. Falling over. It's a little bleak, isn't it? I mean, it's very impressive, but it's also a little forbidding, you know? It doesn't exactly say welcome. I mean, it doesn't say go away, either. Actually, looking at those things, it looks more like it's saying, ah, ah, got something in my throat. But that's probably not it. You come here where you're not wrong. Eat our food, you pollute our city with your stink, and you refuse to help the storm folks. We haven't taken a side because it's not our fight. Hey, maybe the reason these Grayskins don't help in the war is because they're Imperial spies. Imperial spies? You can't be serious. Maybe we'll pay you a visit tonight. You we got ways of finding out what you really are. Ah, uh, good old fashioned tribalism. The Dark Elves. And, oh my are you God. here to bully us and tell us to leave? No, I have absolutely no reason to hate your people. Why would I... You've come to the wrong city, then. Windhelm's a haven of prejudice and narrow thinking. Unworthy of one such as you. Okay. Looks like those Nords were giving you trouble. Why would anyone think you're a spy? It could be the fact that you're wearing a mask and a hood. Uh, just saying. Some of these Nords will come up with any excuse to despise us. Yeah. And it isn't just the Dark Elves they hate. They make a target of the Argonians as well. What about the Khajiit? Just about anyone who isn't a Nord is fair game for their bullying. Oh, does that include Imperials? It looked like they were giving you trouble. Nothing new there. Most of the Nords living in Windhelm don't care much for us. But Rolf is the worst by far. Okay. He likes to get drunk and walk around the Great Quarter yelling insults at us in the small hours of the morning. Oh, a real charmer, that one. Have you thought about, perhaps, stabbing him? Just once or twice? I found that generally improves people's disposition to you. They either become terrified of you, or they're dead. So, just a suggestion. You know, you can think about it. Racism. It's actually one of the more useful uh, features of humanity. It makes it a little easier to control people. I mean, if you're going to rob someone, it's a lot easier if they're staring at someone else with loathing and suspicion. Candle Hearth Hall. This is 
An inn! Probably a good place to start. They have a sewers. Could also be... I'm here. Am I hearing a sound? The sound of a smithy. And where there's a smithy, there's a market. And where there's a market, there might be a bloody torch. Uh, hello, Niranye. I don't haggle. If you want a lower price, look elsewhere. Okay, how long have you been in Windhelm? You're also not uh, annoyed, I notice. I'm sharp like that. Just got here from the Somerset Isles. Lots of opportunity in Skyrim. Like you're thinking, opportunity. Oh, I'm here to pick up something that belongs to Grelka. Oh, yes, that's the woman that sells armor. Or she did before I um acquired it all from her. Are you treated as badly as the Dark Elves? It was difficult at first. The Nords of this city are at best suspicious of outsiders. Okay. But in time, I made the right friends and proved myself useful enough that they don't give me trouble anymore. The Dark Elves are too proud and naive to understand the way things truly are, and so they continue to dwell in that slum. All right, then. Uh, yeah, I'm here to pick up something that belongs to Grelka. I'm afraid I have absolutely no idea what you're speaking of. Um, grumpy Nord woman? I think she's a Nord. She might not be. I wasn't really paying attention. She's always snippy to her customers. Not like you. Uh, give it to me and no one gets hurt. Stop lying. I know you have it. I know. Yes, come on. I still have absolutely no idea what you're speaking of. I don't want to have to offer you money, so I'm not going to. Give me what I'm here for. Are you attempting to threaten me? What in the name of the Divines is wrong with you? Well, I'm not very persuasive, for one. Uh, I keep spending money on things I don't want to spend money on. Now I've got curiosity to add to that list. Do you, oh. Vine? Well, if you insist. Here, yeah, this is for you. It better be worth more Grilka's satchel. She better give me more than 84 gold for this, or I shall be miffed. Yes, I shall. Miffed with a capital M. You have what you came for. Now leave. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. What have you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that Please sort of thing. Please tell me you've got a torch. Just tell me you've got a torch. Give me a torch. Do you have a torch? No, you've got water skins. You don't have a torch. Oh, do you have a lantern? Okay, what do you have? Ooh, nice short sword. Well, I didn't get a torch from her, but... Tools At least I picked up a package that might yourself. earn me a reward. Hilevi Cruelcy. something? Do you grow your own crops, and if so, where? It must be tough to grow anything out here. That was my first thought, actually. There's an old saying that only a Nord can work the soil in Skyrim. I don't think anyone else would have the patience for it. You're it takes half probably a day just right. to dig a planting row in the cold, stony earth here. But what else can we do? Eat rocks and ice? You could import it. Uh, what do you have for sale? Take it's not going to be a torch, is it? No. Wine. It's probably cheap wine. Never mind. You're a butcher. You're... You never know. Maybe this is the butcher that happens to sell a torch as well. need anything. As Come well. see me. I'm as resourceful as I am discreet. Oh. Discreet. I like the sound of that. You live in the Grey Quarter. I'm a dark elf and I live in Windhelm. So yes, I live in the Grey Quarter. The Grey Quarter. Must be new around here. That could be. No, they don't let my kind live anywhere outside that slum. Right. They they could be selling things I want there. Where do you get your goods? Wherever I can find. Them. If you're the type who worries over where something came from, you may want to move on. It's more uh, curiosity rather than worry. Be sure to stop by Sadri's Actually, in the Grey no. When it's meat, uh, I'd rather know where it comes from. Uh, call me picky. White file. Okay, an alchemist who probably won't sell. I'll be fine. <laughs> a torch. Master, you're far too old for this sort of journey. We don't know what's inside. Uh, I'll. I can. <laughs> Just. <clears throat> he may have a point. Whatever your journey See, is. See, you're not well. Have a seat. I'll fetch you some tonic. Oh, if there was a tonic that could help me. 
I would have found it by now. Okay, no, really, excuse me, hello? Hello. Uh, what so were you arguing about? Uh, I'm only asking because I'm insanely nosy. Just a man's life work is all. I finally derived the location of the white file. But this doting busybody won't let me get it. And the white file is... Well, I'll leave you to it then. No, no, if you tell me where it is, I can get it for you. Yes, definitely. The white file. What is the white file? You would do that? Oh, yes. It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help an old man. Oh, well, that's me. It's buried with its maker, Corral Mill, in a long forsaken cave to the west of here. Less Corral me Mill now. was a crafty one. Even in death, you would need the skills of a master alchemist to reach its resting place. Luckily for you, I've already made the mixture. Here, take it. Please, no, don't dally. Why would I need a mixture? With my useless assistant here. I thought I'd just run off somewhere and... Okay, map updated. Uh, here's the... Retrieve the white file. What is the white file? Okay, there you go. A legendary bottle forged in the days when Skyrim was just starting its turn to ice. Okay. A small container made of the magically infused snow that first fell on the throat of the world. It okay, is that does sound cool. That the file will replenish whatever fluid is placed inside of it. For an alchemist like myself. Whatever. It is the most pure expression of my art. To create from nothingness is... poetry. So, for example, I could put fine wine in it and get endless fine wine and become disgustingly rich. Or a strong poison. Why is the file so important to you? Uh, stupid question, but I'm going to ask it anyway. I've spent my entire life searching for it. It brought me all the way to these frozen reaches from the warm embrace of Somerset Isle. Entire years spent in libraries, seeking out tiny villages with local legends that contain but a whisper of a hint of the file. I even named my shop after it, hoping that it might attract anyone who had heard of it. And now it's within my grasp. But the eight, it seems, <coughs> have chosen me for their amusement. <coughs> for in my current condition... Sorry about my stomach. I'll never be able to lay my hands on it. Why are you still standing around here? Go get me the file, you fool! Okay, that that's not helping. Um, out of curiosity... May the eight guide you to the file. Yeah, but what do you have for sale? Just... So... You're interested in my potions and ingredients? <sighs> Not as much as I am a torch, which you probably don't have, and therefore, unless you have a potion of, oh, potion of night vision, maybe? A potion of nightiness? A potion of bloody great big light? I suppose I could get a scroll that casts light or something to follow me around occasionally, but uh, frostbite venom. Uh, no, I'm 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 going to try and make my own venom from now on. I Hope think. Hope to see you again soon. Okay. Um. Now. I'm hungry. Right. You 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 gave me a location somewhere. Where? I probably need to go to the journal. For white funnel. Retrieve the white file. And that is ah oh, over there. Forsaken Cave. I have to tell you, I'm I'm not big on caves and things, although I have to say, a legendary file that refills a liquid. Well, that, that definitely is intriguing. If there was anything that would get me to go crawling around in a disgusting cave, that might be it. However... Working in Not great. without a torch, anyway. Close. Okay, Ulfric, met him. Very disappointing. Hermir Strongheart. I never expected Ulfric to live up to his legend. 
But he does. No, he doesn't. So you admire him then, right? Every Nord should admire Ulfric. He fights for all of us. In fact, he's the reason I chose to learn this hunting trade. I want to make weapons and armor for the great Stormcloak army. Okay. Um, I hate to break it to you, but he's probably doing it for himself. Everyone is. Do you like being a blacksmith? Smithing isn't the most exciting thing for me, but we all have to lend a hand as best we can. If a Stormcloak uses one of my swords to strike down an Imperial soldier, then I've done my part to free our land. Okay, you're not going to sell me anything. I was hoping a we would get to know each other and you'd say, Oh look! Here is my... Here's what I have, and it includes a torch. You're the castle blacksmith. Of course I am. What do I look like? A tavern wench? Oh, uh, don't yes. let my words cut you too deep. I've just been working the forge too hard. Trying to set this sword right. What's so what's your words next time? No no no, what's so special about this sword? I am Jarl wants it to look like an ancient flame. High Queen Friedrich ruled over Windhelm in the second era. Her sword was legendary. Legendary Getting swords? A real sword would be even better than making a copy. But no one wants to risk getting it from its resting place. Let me see if I can guess what's going to happen next. I don't blame them. Maybe the Jarl should retrieve the sword himself. No, if you tell me where it is, I'll think about getting it. But probably not. If you find that sword, Traveller, I'd be grateful. I mean, you never know. It... Uh, does war mean good business for you? It probably does. I don't see these troubles as business. This is a labor of honor. Then you're not very smart. His rightful glory. I would hammer a thousand shields. Shores bones. I might just have to. Okay, and how is your steel? Every bit as sharp as what you'll find in White Run. I hear I differently. Your, but he has the good fortune to work the sky for. Something about the fires. Their steel just holds tighter. If that makes any sense. None whatsoever to me, I'm afraid. However, now we've got the chit chat out of the way. To protect yourself or deal some damage. Believe it or not, so I can see. Please have a torch. Oh, come on. Have a torch. I mean, oh, really, yeah. have a torch. Somebody. Blacksmith's quarters. Somebody should have a torch around here. I mean, I appreciate it's probably always pretty bright because of the snow. Although not at night. Well, that, that depends, you see. The, 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 the snow does reflect even the smallest amount of light, so fires would actually make the place look brighter than you'd imagine. Okay, what's over this side? I'm going to check the inn, but I, I have a feeling... We don't have... Oh, I'm hungry. I have a feeling we don't have any uh, torches in an inn. What do we have down here? Okay. Okay, that goes out. I see colour. It's not that simple. Ulfric wants Skyrim for the Nords. Doesn't trust what he Ah, oh, this looks hopeful. You've seen how we live? Cramped alleys, run-down buildings, few guard patrols. Even the name Grey Quarter is an insult. I'll speak to Alfred soon, but I make no promises that I can change his mind. That's all I ask. With your help, we have a chance to make a better life for ourselves here. For that, I thank you. There's no glory in war. It's just something they tell soldiers so they'll risk their lives. That's very wise and clever. Which makes you a dangerous man. Uh, Sadri's used wares. Now, Let me know a, if you see anything you like. A used torch is unlikely. Okay, I see some things that I I like. Uh, but that's probably All not what you my meant. goods are legitimate. Which is more than I can say for some. Uh, I didn't care so much. I like to share my good fortune with those who deserve it. Nothing in here is stolen. Nothing at all. Of course nothing in here is stolen. Only a careless, shameful, idiotic fetcher would do something as stupid as to buy pilfered goods. 
Would you happen to know Zurai where I could find such a person? I bought a gold ring, and Viola Giordano has been missing a ring that looks just like it. Oh! Well, that was remarkably stupid of you. I like that. Can I have it? Um, I could return the ring for you. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you give me a ring, and I return it to whoever it was stolen from. Or take it somewhere else. It's not that easy. She'd go to the Jarl if she knew I was even remotely involved. You have to get it to her some other way. Look, it's dangerous. But if you sneak the ring into her house, put it in a dresser or something, I will make it worth your while. Viola's gold ring added. How worth my while would you make it? It's just uh, I probably know somebody who might actually pay for that. Here's the thing. Surely that's the best thing. You give me the ring, I take it away. Far, far away. Nobody ever has to know. You see? Win-win. Who supplies your goods? I've scraped this collection together by whatever means I could. I do some business with the trade caravans, and I've picked up a number of items from adventurers like yourself. A few intrepid souls even brought some items back from Morvenskar, the fort southwest of the city. Okay. What have you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Thing is, is I cannot wander around constantly buying absolutely everything. Oh god, something just got grabbed my attention. I was going to say everything that grabs my attention. T -t 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 Torch! Come on! <sighs> Silver goblet, that's not what I s Jeweled goblet. See, I want a jeweled goblet now. I've got a jeweled pitcher. And I keep meaning to sell it, but uh, then I don't, because it's shiny, and I like it. I am right, so you don't have a torch then. You don't have a torch, and you probably don't have anything. Increase the duration of alchemical potions by 15%. I already have that enchantment. I took it off a, a helmet. However, perhaps wearing a ring... That is probably yeah, 755. Um, no. You know what? I may be back later on catch you in her house. to see if I can, uh, I don't know, acquire that item some other way. I was not saying that out loud. No, I wasn't. Okay. Do we have New Gnisis Corner Club? Oh. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. Yes, I shall not be eating here. However, Varicio the Collector. Uh, what are you doing? Isn't it obvious? I'm working with my collection. Collection of what? You ask a lot of questions, don't you? Yes. Fate cards. <gasps> now leave me alone. I'm losing count. I found one. I have one. Fate cards. I have. I do. I have. This is a weird stroke of luck. One might say fate. Really? That's amazing. I haven't found that many people who keep a hold of them. These Nords are magical neophytes and use them as kindling. If you are interested in starting a collection or making a trade, I'd be interested in seeing what you have. What a... I also have a few spare rare cards I'd be willing to sell. Oh, no! Ah! I, I'd like to trade a card. I can trade them. What cards have you got for sale? I have a few choice cards. I'm going to end up poor. Price. I'm going to end up very, very poor. Oh, my God. No, I'm not, because I'm not going to buy these. Um, Or I may, but just not right now. Oh, okay. So, wait a minute. We've got a card of spiders... Queen. This means there is a there's there's a there's a spider's deck, there's a builder's deck, there's a traveler's deck, and there's a wall's deck. I don't know what I've got. I've got mystics. There's also a mystics deck. <gasps> okay. I need these in my life, but I can't afford that right now. I I I assume you're going to be here. I'd like to trade a card. Would I? I. Great. I'll give you a matching card from a different deck. What deck are you trading? Oh, from? I see. So, no, never mind. Never mind. Sorry. Uh, if I get multiple cards, I can trade them for other decks. 
Interesting. Yes, indeed. Excuse me. I'm going to snack, but I'm going to snack something from my uh, own person backpack. Ambaris Rendar. Apparently, some Nord women were murdered. Not sure why I should care. Not sure why you think I should care either. Um, why are there so many dark elves here? There are rather a lot, aren't there? Where else would we be? When oh. the Red Mountain burned, oh, yeah. you could scarcely breathe in Morrowind. So we came west. Windhelm is the first city on that road. And here we are. If we had known the Nords would be so unwelcoming, we may have kept walking. Well, you still have feet, so I'd like a refill of water. Actually, I would, yes. Of course. Although, I do hope the water's cleaner than the rest of the place. Uh, okay, how are the Dark Elves treated in Windhelm? I think I already know the answer to that. Well, you see where we have to live. This forgotten alley. All the filth from the upper quarters flows downhill, what they say. Good luck getting one of the guards to help with anything. I tried to get Ulfric to even come down here to see the squalor, but the High Lord of His Mightiness couldn't find the time. Yeah, well, it would help if you cleaned the place up a little. I mean, I'm only here because I'm in desperate need of a torch. Um, so there have been murders, have there? None of that matters to me. Until someone takes a Dunmer, I'll let Windhelm deal with its own problems. Fair enough. Uh, what do you have for sale? Please Take a look. tell me it includes a torch. No, it doesn't include a torch. Do you need another How drink? hard right is here. it to find a bloody burning stick? Okay, so we've got a residence. And... Oh, Lalu. I recognize that name. So that's it now. Just a lot of residences. I've visited all of the shops that I can see. Fine. What on earth is that? That looks kind of like a guard tower type. Oh, Temple of Talos. You know what? Let's just check out what's in there. In case someone dropped a torch. Because, you know... You know, considering you guys are waging a war over this uh, Talos worship thing, these pews are awfully empty. Hello. I've spent my life serving Talos. I don't plan to stop now, no matter what the Empire says. That's nice. Talos created the Empire. You'd think they'd show him more respect. Yes, yes. You'd think they'd show him... Hello. Jora. To receive the blessing of Talos, you have only to pray at the altar. Okay, no, I was actually Blessings of Talos be upon you. Yeah. I'm not even seeing torches. I mean, there's a sewer here. Maybe someone's left some torches down in the sewer. But the entire point of having torches is so that when you go into a place like the sewer, you can see what you're stepping in. It's kind of, you know, it feels a little redundant to... We've got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. I don't suppose you have torches. Spare a coin for an old woman, my lord. Ah. Okay. I've been a bit out of sorts since... since our daughter was taken from us. Oh, that's terrible. Uh, do you have a torch? This here's Candle Hearth Hall. Great rooms upstairs, and there's a bed for rent on the ground floor. Are you mad? I mean, I, 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 I don't mind if you're, if you're schizophrenic, but, but you are speaking in completely different voices. Why is this called Candle Hearth Hall? Did you see the candle above the fire upstairs? Nope. It was lit 163 years ago, back when this building was the home of a grand warrior named Wundheim. Wundheim, When okay. word came that he'd fallen, his son Durot lit the candle in his honor. Nobody knows why it still burns. Because it's magic. Uh, there you go. You're welcome. Um, what do you have for sale? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Take a look. A talk. Oh. Enjoy your stay. And don't break nothing. Double negative. Uh, Dalen Merchant. Never much cared for Windhelm. The place is depressing. It's the lack of torches. 
Angrenor once honored, Tova Shatter Shield. Sorry, but I'm not looking to hire any more crew right now. Neither am I. Leviathan Morganite Stone. Oh! Ah! That was one of the tasks I was here to do. Steal? I'm not selling that to him. I don't know what that is, but I want it. Come on, come on. I'm actually here to steal an awful lot of stuff, and I just stole an awful lot of stuff. However, I plan on stealing more. Although, I'm wondering whether I should leave a little. There, There is an argument to be made that... You should never steal everything, because you put people out of business. Whereas if you steal a little, you can come back later and steal more when they've acquired more. You see? That's the basic thinking. There is another sort of thinking that says just steal everything right now. Cause it's there. Forge Numbers Business Ledger. Is that the other task I've got? Have I, by sheer accident, found the task? Sign it right. Return to Delvin, steal 500. Um, okay. The heist jobs. I probably should have actually marked these. Should I not? Uh, we're right. No. Fishing job. That's solitude. Windhelm. Make changes in the ledger at Candlehearth Hall in Windhelm. <laughs> Oh, you see, Lady Luck loves me. Yes, she does. This means I'm actually done here. I've done everything I came to do, except find a bloody torch. You don't know what course. freedom really means until you've lived on the river. Oh, I'm not sure about freedom, but that probably would tell me what cold and wet means. Okay, I'm, I'm not seeing anything that makes me, uh, I'm just going to warm myself up by, by the fire. Ooh, it's nice and warm. I shall stand here quietly for a long time. Yes, I know I said don't steal everything, but then I also said, yes, steal everything. I'm a complicated person, okay? Sentence 62, thank you very much. Venison? Could be good. Okay. Raw rabbit leg? No, I've, I've actually got food. Oh, I'm nice and warm now. Where does this go? Okay, uh, Rolf Stonefist, Torbjörn's Shatter Shield, Susanna the Wicked. Hello. How can Elda hate the Dark Elves when she knows so little about them? Um, what's on the menu? What are we talking about? Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both. Oh, we are actually talking about food. We're talking about... Oh, never mind. Never mind. I, uh... See you around, handsome. And you're just selling food, right? Okay. You didn't hear it from me, but if you want a real drink, try the Corner Club in the Grey Quarter. I, 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 I will. Thank you very much. Okay. Um... Why are those three staring at me? Could uh, somebody Mom say? Mom bought any flowers again today. I don't know what to do. Um, find another job. Luafin? Hmm? Can I make a request? Oh, you're mm -hmm. a bard. No, thank you. No, you. Name's Nils. I'm the cook up at Candlehearth Hall. That's fascinating. Voltsia Girion. I'm a sailor on the North Wind. We're laying over. I have no idea North why I'm actually wandering around trying to talk to people now. Spare a coin. No. Talos rewards the generous. If it's a mercenary Denmark. you're looking for, you found him. 
There's no stronger sword arm for hire in all sky. No, if I'm going to hire a mercenary, I... Adonato Leotelli? I know that name. I'm a writer by trade. Not that the Probably that's sky why. Okay, right. So, what I have to do now is decide what I'm going to do now. I could return to Delvin with the great news that I have already done more than those guys have probably done in ages because they do seem to be a little well lazy to be honest or I could where was the other one uh oh it's probably the miscellaneous plant Viola's gold ring in the dresser in Viola Giordano's house in Windhelm or let Viola in on Raven's scheme <gasps> Ooh. I don't know I don't know. Bo both have, um... Well, there's a certain... There's a certain charm to both of them. However, if I plant the ring... That would probably... Get me uh, a reward from somebody who is uh, a merchant in the Grey Quarter. That could be a good contact. Okay, the house is over in that direction. You know what? I think I'm going to do this. Not only will I get a, a reward from the trader, who doesn't have a torch, but I'm uh, sure that this residence I'm going to will have other items. And how hilariously ironic is that? I've been tasked with returning some stolen goods so that somebody gets out of trouble. And instead, I simply rob the place blind but put the one thing back that I was supposed to. And, uh... Behind me. Viola Giordano's house. Now it's open, which means I should better stroll in and say hi. You lost? Hi. I'm, uh, yes, maybe a little. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. Okay, no, never mind, never mind. The butcher, sorry, be I... Be careful. That murderer could be anywhere, and anyone. Um, uh, could, I, could I use your bathroom? Do you, uh... Do you, do you have a, a toilet I could use? I'm, I'm really in need, and, and you look like a really nice old lady, and, and that would be jolly helpful if you could uh, just uh, point me in the direction. Thank you. Okay. Where exactly did he want me to place it? Was it some sort of dresser, perhaps? Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, there we go. In the dresser! The dresser we're looking for. That's a wardrobe. There's a wardrobe. Probably in the bedroom. Is there anyone else here? Steel boots. Chest. Chest. Making sure there's nobody else. Steal from a wardrobe. Fine boots. Fine. Ooh. Ooh. A cape. Fine clothes, different fine clothes. Why not? Fine boots, they do not look very fine. Wardrobe, I should... Oh, fine hat. Don't like the hat. Eh, maybe the shoes. Yes, why not? Okay. <laughs> Is this the dresser? No, that's an end table. You would think a gentleman like me would know what a dresser looks like. Oh, right. So this is the dresser and she's staring right at it. I should have guessed. Knapsack. And out of curiosity, when does she go to sleep? It's, uh, it's pretty early. And she doesn't seem to mind me hanging around. Maybe she's lonely. Maybe she's lonely. I could sit here and talk to her. Uh, okay. 
Are you wanting me to leave now? Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. Okay, thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you. Definitely. That's good advice. That is really good advice. Okay, and I, I'm supposed to place here the the ring. Where was it? No, it wasn't that. Viola's gold ring, which is worth 155. I could probably sell that for, I don't know how much you could sell that at the fence. Probably a lot less than that, like 40 or 50. Okay. Or let Viola in on it. Right, tell Revin in Grey Quarter the gold ring has been planted. Okay, well, to be honest with you, I've picked up enough stuff that I've more than made up for the, uh, for the, uh, cost of the ring. And whatever else he gives me will be extra. And we met a nice old lady who gave us some advice about not talking to the butcher or something. To be honest with you, he seemed very suspicious, didn't he, with his meat? And I am talking about the produce on the cart before anyone makes any rude jokes. And I'm lost, aren't I? Where, where the hell am I going? Down here. Right. So, we tell him the good news. Was it, was it here? Yes, it was. Oh, no. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. Yes, it was you. If Why is not, he... let me know. I might have it stored away. Oh, hi! Um... Have you taken care of that little problem? Yes, I have. Thank you very much. Um, here you go. I placed it. Can I have my reward? Thank you. Thank you. Azura's prophecy always guides you to fortune. It, it will. It will. Speaking and if I sound fortune, like I'm in a hurry, it's here. because I am. Everything I earned from my last shipment, it's yours. Okay, how much? 400! Nice! I'd like training in the art of speech. I, no, I wouldn't. Uh, Until later, then. Okay, yeah, no, uh, I, I've got, I'm in a rush, I've got to go, bye! Hello, and welcome, Okay, stay there, stay there. Have a look around. I buy and sell just about anything. I'm up. Okay. Ooh! Always happy to see a customer. But I won't deal in stolen goods. That's trouble I don't need. Okay, hi. No, I, um, was just looking at some of this nice stuff you have. I was just about to leave. Yes, I was. I was on my way. So you could go Make to yourself at home, please. Let me know if I can be of any assistance. So you're not feeling sleepy then? 